Yo, what's good? I'm out here walking Raven the Giant. Raven say what's good. <laughs> and uh, I had posed a question for all of my Twitter, my Twitter followers, over 3,000 people interacted with this question, okay? The question was, ladies, how many times y'all letting a man come back after doing some fuck shit? Okay, we all do some fuck shit. I do some fuck shit. It's a double-edged sword type of question here. And I got a lot of very interesting responses. Probably a 50-50 split of responses of realism versus, versus like faces. Realism versus textbook answer versus uh, like what's really real. How many times they really will and why. And then them saying that they won't, which is the truth in a lot too, but that's a whole nother story. But the reason why people cannot be true to themselves is because they cannot, or they haven't, taken the time to be by themselves for an extended period of time, okay? And when I say like by themselves, completely by themselves, at least 30 days or more, where it's just you, Little to no interaction with the human race or with people. But some people have not spent time, an extended period of time with themselves to know exactly who they are, what they are, what they like, what they really like, what they don't like. And a lot of people out here only like what they like because of the people around them, but they really don't like it. A lot of people are who they are because of the people around them, but not themselves. And that's why they always seem like they're fake. Or they're bougie, or they just don't know. That's like the person that's always saying, oh, it's too quiet in here. They have never been alone with themselves to know themselves, which is crazy. And when you know yourself, you will be able to be true to yourself 100%. And getting some of these answers from the ladies and the men off Twitter, well, I could tell where someone was like, all right, this is a real answer right here. And then other ones like, this girl knows she lying. This lady knows she lying. And you could just tell from the response. Because when you're true to yourself, you could tell who is and who isn't true to themselves. It's almost like a mirror, mirror effect. But you know, you'll be able to just decipher it. But stay true to yourself. When you're true to yourself, you can be true to everyone else.